there could be more infected people than the three. Initially, remember, we were told by health ministry that there were, three, there were two. Now they've added the third one. Our point is very clear here that because we do not have sufficient testing capacity, because some people are entering our country without being tested, because we're not everywhere, and we're spending money on Bill 10 and other unnecessary activities, because workshops are continuing, workshops are continuing, we are aware of that, spending money, we are not equipping ourselves enough in terms of testing capacity, facilities, in terms of care capability in the case of an individual that's identified. It is therefore true that a lot of individuals are not being tested as they enter this country. You are aware that at intercity bus stop, at KMB in Kitwe, no one is being tested. And if a person comes by bus from another country, by boat from another country, our borders are porous, they are not being tested because we don't have the capacity to test them everywhere, including when they've entered Zambia, to connect from the landing point to another town, to another province in Zambia. We are not testing them. It is true, it is probable that there will be more cases than three. I think that's the argument we're making. That's why we are recommending on measure number two. First, measure number one, complete lockdown. For 14 days at least, we monitor the situation. 14, if necessary, 21 days. And measure number two, to enhance the testing of COVID and extend the testing services to all the provinces and all potential areas, such as intercity. Only then we can determine. <coughs> Even then we will not have a full determination, but we will we'll be getting closer to the extent of the infections. I think it's only logical, it's only true, that we are not in the know of how many are infected. And that's the worry. And that's why we need to lock down. And that's why we need to suspend vigorous expenditure and activities such as Biotene and other measures. Thank you.